All right, hello everyone, it's Happy, and today we're going to be talking about one of the most OP tanks Wargaming has ever added to World of Tanks Blitz, and that is the Kampfpanzer 50T. Now let's compare it to the T62, which is of course one of the stronger mediums at tier 10. So in terms of armor, uh, the Kampfpanzer basically destroys the T62. The hull armor on the Kampfpanzer is a lot better, and the turret is also very strong. So you have hull and turret armor on a medium tank, all right? Now, getting armor out of the way, we go to the DPM, and here the Kampfpanzer 50T wins again with almost 3,700 DPM, while the T62 only has 3,600, not even 3,600, right? So on top of that, on top of that, the Alpha on the Kampfpanzer 50T is 320, the T62 is 310. So the Kampfpanzer 50T is going to be shredding tanks to oblivion. Now the aim time on both tanks is pretty much the same, However, the dispersion on the Kampfpanzer 50T is better than the T62. So you pretty much have a tank with better armor, more DPM, and a better with better accuracy. I don't know what to expect from Wargaming at this point. And if you think that's not enough, the Kampfpanzer 50T has 60 kilometers forward, while the T62 only has 55, with a better horsepower per ton compared to the T62. So if you guys thought that the T62 is one of the strongest tier 10 mediums, then you have the Kampfpanzer, which beats it in regards to armor, DPM, gun handling, and speed. So pretty much in every single... In every single comparison, the Kampfpanzer beats the T62. Now, we're not even going to compare the object, uh, uh, object 140 and tanks like that to the Kampfpanzer. Because comparing tanks like the E50M at this point is just going to be useless. Just think about how strong this new tank is and how it doesn't make sense to add it into the game. On top of that, of course, it's a collector tank, meaning that it's going to be in crates and it's going to be sold for money. So again, players with money or people who spend money in the game will be able to get one of the strongest tier 10 tanks in general. This tank has more armor than some heavy tanks at tier 10. For God's sake, that is just stupid. It has one of the most DPM at uh, tier 10 in regards to mediums. Uh, one of the best, of course. And again, armor, mobility, and gun. That is the perfect combination to make an OP tank. So literally, this tank does everything better than normal tech tree tanks. Everything. And uh, if that's not OP, I don't know what is. So tell me what you guys think about this tank in the comment section below. And with that, happy is out, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.